जी मैं कंपेयर तो नहीं कर सकता बिकॉज आई हैवेंट सीन एज मेनी मैचेस ऑफ कपिल देव बट आई बिलीव धोनी इज़ द बेस्ट कैप्टन इंडिया इज एवर हैड जितना भी मैं देख चुका हूँ एंड आई एम नॉट सेंग इट क्योंकि आई नो एम पर्सनली ही इज़ रियली द बेस्ट कैप्टन इंडिया इज एवर हैड और जितने सारे वर्ल्ड कप के मैचेज हैं मैं फॉलो कर रहा हूँ इनफैक्ट ये भी मैच फॉलो कर रहा था मैं आज श्रीलंका वर्सेज स्कॉटलैंड आई थॉट इट वॉज वन फोर्टी फाइव फॉर वन टिल आई लास्ट सॉ इट उसके बाद तो आई हैव लॉस्ट ट्रैक बट आई फॉलो इट वेरी वेल एंड आई होप इंडिया रिमेन्स एट दैट लेवल मुझे यही डर है कि इंडिया शुड नॉट है पीक टू सून क्योंकि पाँच मैच अगर लगातार हम लोग जीते आई थिंक मे प्लेइंग बांग्लादेश इन द क्वार्टर्स मेरे हिसाब से या सो आई जस्ट होप आ गुड फॉर्म कंटिन्यूज एंड आई होप लाइक दिस ए वी वॉन्ट गिव इट बैक राइट Yes, I hope back. we we get the World Cup back. Yeah, very back soon. The last couple of questions. Are there. In terms of size, in terms of volume, it's the biggest issue of Penta. He's he's being nice to me because I'm sitting here. <laughs> it, it truly is. It's the biggest issue we've ever done. Yes. Uh, questions for John? Anything else? John, I have a question. One very poignant story in in the article that you've written in your interview mm. talks about. Um, um, you know how you went to hollywood after facing an injury after having an accident and you despite being a big bollywood star you had to actually convince a trainer over there to uh, prove yeah. your dedication to him to to train you yeah. right uh, uh, wasn't did you find it belittling in any which way and you spoken so honestly about it yeah. what do you have to say about that so i went to uh, los angeles in uh, 2006 after my accident yes. or uh, i was on crutches then and i'd lost all my work in the industry because all the producers came and gave me my money back saying you can't walk but fair enough i couldn't walk and uh, then i it was a motorbike accident there was a motorbike accident and um, i googled uh, at that point of time the best trainer and uh, they took me to la and i went and i met a trainer there called mike ryan and um, he came out into the parking lot and he said um, you got to pay 100 dollars an hour and i said yeah i'll pay it and then he said uh, wait here and he came out and he gave me dumbbells and i couldn't walk i just got off crutches and he said do the lunges and while doing lunges lunges means you keep one leg ahead then one leg ahead and you bend down while doing lunges i fell and he said get up and i said but i've got hurt he said have you come here to work out or have you come here to make excuses so get up i got up i had tears in my eyes because of the pain but i continued doing it and for one week i did lunges in the parking lot and then i went into the gym then he got me to the gym to work out and that's when i started working out so my only point i'm trying to make is you could be you could have a thousand complaints in your life ki ye dukh raha hai ye dukh raha hai mere paas time nahi hai ye khana nahi milta hai mere ghar pe koi khana nahi banata hai you can have a thousand excuses you have to get over all these excuses if you have to if you have to be the best There's no other way for each one of you. Jamal, sorry, uh, can I introduce everybody to Vinod as well? Uh, so we have here Vinod Chanda, who's uh, John's trainer. He's the guy responsible for that team. Can we have a round of applause for him? So, so Vinod has um, Vinod has um, actually Vinod has uh, trained me for uh, horse and shootout at Badala and race two and now Rocky Hansen, and he's responsible uh, for. For this great physique, and like I say, trainers are always your gurus. So it's always good to have uh, someone who has more knowledge than you do, and um, it's great that he's here. Uh, and I can never thank him enough. Just like I can never thank anybody who's helped me in my life enough. So on a parting note, I'd also like to honestly thank Dabu. Very few people know he's responsible for my success. This man actually shot my. portfolio when i had no money and uh, uh, you know we we tend to forget and grow too big but this man is actually responsible for for everything that i am today and jamal is not a a journalist to me very honestly jamal is my oldest friend when i first became a model and i have seen this boy grow and grow and grow and today is the editor of one magazine and very soon to be announced maybe three four others so i always feel happy when i see people who are close to me grow and he's grown and it just feels i i feel very proud and i'm a fan of men's health and it's great to be on the cover because when you show your body you'd rather show it on a men's health than on a film magazine 
So I'm happy I'm on the right magazine to show my body. So this, so. Is, uh, this is one of the, Vinod, thanks for being here. Yeah, We're glad you. you're here. You want to, uh, let me also tell you guys that uh, this is one of the few covers that John has shot in years. Yeah. Yes. Uh, he has. Uh, he's not a person who you know goes and does too many interviews and shoots. And stuff. Yeah, I've been abused yeah. by my uh, agents. They say, "Na to tum shadiyo mein naachte ho, na award function mein jaate ho, na covers karte ho, kuch nahi karte ho, paisa kaha milega main?" And I say, "Listen, I want to do less work, but I want to do good work, which is one of the reasons why." No one seen me on screen for at least one and a half years now. It's because after Madras Cafe, I didn't get anything that was exciting enough. And uh, I honestly welcome back is something that makes me happy. As a child, I feel very happy. Brings out the kid in me. It's a universal film. No double meaning. No exposure. No dirty language. After long, you're going to get to get to see a film where you can take your entire family and not be embarrassed. And I think Welcome Back is that film. And after that, I've got. A film that's close to my heart. That's Rocky Handsome. So, you know, again, I always have a relationship with the media. That's uh, now you see him, now you don't. But you all have always been great, and thank you for coming here today. But John, I think the biggest uh, sign here, because yeah. he believes in fitness, his cover is out not to promote a film of his. He believes in a fit lifestyle, and he wants that message to go out to as many people as possible. So, thank you for that, John. We hope we wish you the best in the film when Thanks. they happen later in the year. And uh, we have a few one-on-one -on -one interviews, but thank you all for being here. I uh, hope you had fun, and I uh, hope you're going to stick around for a longer time. Thanks for listening to my uh, boring fitness tips. <laughs> Thanks, thanks. <laughs> 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 <laughs>